to talk to you a minute about <clears throat> playing down to the competition. I was watching <clears throat> my NFL team play yesterday, a game they should have won, a game they were favored to win, a game they were favored to win by 10 plus points, and they lost in overtime. One of the things that we have to be mindful of is playing down to the competition. I think it's something that we can learn in life. There are people who, perhaps your children or perhaps a spouse or a friend or relative, there are people that you know, no doubt, have great potential, but when they get around other people or when they associate with other people who don't necessarily have the potential that they have or the opportunities that they have, amazingly, they play down or people sometimes play down to the people that they are around. It's something that we've got to be mindful of in life because it's just so easy to take things for granted, to take people for granted, to take an endeavor for granted, or even to take a fight for granted. I remember when, Bust, when uh, um, Mike Tyson lost to Buster Douglas. Buster Douglas was at his best on that night. Mike didn't train like he should have trained. <clears throat> Here's the lesson. Every opponent is an opponent and every opponent on a given day can be better than you. And so that's why it's always important to be your best, to do your best, not to dummy yourself down to your company. I heard Shannon Sharp say something which was very powerful. <clears throat> if you always have to compensate for your friends, then chances are, he said, his grandmother said, and I'm paraphrasing, you need to get you some new friends. And so it's important to understand that water seeks its level. Always do your best. Always give your best, regardless of the situation. Never take anything or anybody for granted. I pray this word today gave you strength for the journey.